listening to episode four of Over the Moon for You. Okay, before we get started, so I know some people are probably wondering, oh, okay, what the hell is going on? Alright, so at first, cause, because of the fact is I woke up really, really late, it's still Friday for me because it's like a couple minutes to Friday, I mean Saturday, Um, I woke up like really, really late today and I was like, am I going to be able to get everything out today? No. Like, at first I thought I was, and then the more and more, like, everything was all coming out and stuff, I was like, there's no way in hell I'm going to be able to. So, as as I said, as much as it pains me, um, I didn't want to drop this, so I was like, well, let me put it on hold, and let me just, like, every week kind of watch two episodes at once, so then by the time, like, the finale or episode 11 came out, I would have had all the others, and I could have just, like, gave it to you all at once through, um in the past few days before the fa- uh, last few episodes came out, and I think about an hour or two ago, I kept thinking about it, and thinking about it, and thinking about it, and I was like, you know what, screw it, I was like, I'd rather just continue trying to have it out on Friday for you guys and stuff, instead of just like, putting it on hold, or just dropping it completely, and then also talking to some people who are close to me about it. Um, who would also be okay with it and stuff, even though I don't want to put it out on a Saturday, we're still going to have it come out on a Friday, so, yeah, your girl just has to wake up early, I mean, because, like, I can't sleep sometimes at night, no offense, (laughs) because (laughs) I just can't, I'm one of those, I'm a night owl, and sometimes I don't go to bed until, like, the wee hours of the freaking morning, and, yeah, but, yeah, we're continuing, we're going to see what the hell happened in today's episode between... Sukasa and the blonde Rin, cause the blonde the blonde girl looked like fucking Rin. I- I'm just saying, but yeah. Other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode four and three, two, one, go. It is not playing for me now. Hold on. Nope, cause we're gonna do that again, cause it just like. <laughs> okay, hold on. Alright, take two, and three, two, one, go. There we go, yay. Oh, I was about to say, I'm like, are we watching episode one again? Excuse me. So were you homeless or something? I mean, but, okay. I don't know. It's something either, because at first, I think in episode one, I thought she was sick. Because when she was like, yeah, okay, yeah, if I do this, you promise you got to marry me later on. And I'm like, okay, what's the reason? Are you sick? You got family problems at home, you got money problems possibly, I still can't even figure it out because I have no clue. Mm-hmm. Oh no, so it's not their thing. Oh, her shoes so pretty. Yeah. <laughs> oh, maybe he has work. But I get that. He 
should be back soon, maybe. I mean, how the hell he not have a key when it's this fucking apartment, you know? I mean, day one, episode one, you know, show with the shit. They should have, like, gone out. No, because it was nighttime, so they have they would have had to wait until the next day. But still, like, episode two or episode three, they should have went to, like, oh my god, not, like a, a, a Home Depot or Lowe's or something, somewhere where you can get keys. Yeah, but he's a guy. He would have that stuff. <laughs> That's a good question. Or you can just make lunch for yourself. Oh, Ren. <laughs> oh, okay, she's outside. All right, all right, we're gonna call you Chee Chan. Yeah, she's right, she. I'm guessing not. Yeah, and of course, she can't come home and live there now because she's married. And watch. I mean, she's going to go back. So, <laughs> mom, they're like, hey, um, so Casa got married. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to be like, stop this wedding. <laughs> this marriage. Uh, NASA. Out of all the people, NASA would come home now. You gonna give her candy? Oh. Can you taste these? Oh. NASA. Oh, just wait until you find out who it is. Oh, don't worry. You will. Yeah. 
exactly. That's why you should have gotten an extra key between episodes one through three. <laughs> Wait, gee! Yeah. Uh-huh. Huh? <laughs> this boy. Because <laughs> or Chi Chan. Well, un unfortunately, Chi, you're going to have to because, I mean, they're now legally married. Mm-hmm. And he's literally like the perfect boyfriend or husband. She? Because she doesn't want any trouble specifically with her. I mean, because, see, the biggest thing I want to know is, what kind of trouble is this girl in? Like, what the fuck is it? Money problems? Do you need money? Hair? I swear to God. What? <laughs> you cute. Like, you like, um... You a seven, boo-boo. You so cute, though. I date you. God, fucking hair. Jesus. Pretty. Yeah, you guys are adorable. You know, he could have possibly left by now. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Wear it. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. Oh my god. <laughs> Are you really going to spend time looking for her room? Oh. It'd be funny if that was it. it smells of... Uh-huh. Trophy. No, 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 like a trophy. Oh shit. Hey. Charlotte, you got the Buster Sword? I, I think that's a Gundam reference. I mean. That could literally be any Gundam series, like, because the last one I watched was Seed, and that's my personal favorite. Yeah, I mean, you're gonna destroy it! Too late. Oh. Oh! It's nitrogen! No, because I want to know too. I mean, mm, how bad do I really want to know? Really bad, but is it like that bad? Do I want to spoil myself? Not really. But then she has to be really famous or something. <laughs> oh. NASA, I love you so much. <laughs> but I, I don't think that's it, baby. Oh, she. Yeah, because you fall in love with her, too. That's okay. <laughs> I know, because both of them barely know, like, this much about each other.
you gonna do? Um, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the power of photo editing. <laughs> oh, hey! It's not what you think. I think so, yes. <laughs> she knows it's fake. <laughs> yeah, to buy some time. Oh, that's so smart. Yeah, and you know you're going to have to ask her one day. Hopefully soon. <laughs> Come here, Code. Oh, there you are. Oh, I got you. I'm almost done. It's pretty. This is where you can propose. <laughs> this church in the middle of nowhere. Lay down. Oh. Seriously, whoever plays him, and I think I know who plays him. Oh my god. You're doing so good. Oh. And people said they didn't like him. He's so likable. What is wrong with you? This is a cute episode. That was like the cutest way to propose to someone else. Oh, NASA can't even see. Me. I mean, you know, Connor's sister is still gonna try to get with him, right? <laughs> uh, okay, she. I. I. I <laughs> 
<laughs> I don't even know what to say about Chi. Chi is interesting. I will say that. She she's funny. She is a little sundere and just adorable as can boot. But I mean, the relationship between her and Sukasa is very like nice. And you can tell, like, it was obvious that she is so heavily in love with her. I think almost like any person that Sukasa has like Immediately, possibly met because you know you've seen it now with two people, both Nasa and Chi. Both of them like immediately fell out of her heels in love with her, and she. I think she has that most when it is the main character girl, best girl ish. It always happens like that, so I'm not really that surprised. But it's just something about her that is just like every person is immediately drawn to. But my biggest issue is the situation about her. There's something else here, and. Maybe it is obvious as hell. Maybe it's not obvious. Who knows? Only people who've read the manga know. And as someone who is not reading this manga, I don't know ish. I would love to know what the big issue is with her because it's something. And whatever it is, I hope we do get to find out soon. So, I mean, like, not like episode five. I would say maybe like six to 12 because I think this show has like 12 episodes, I believe. But. I don't know. It between, you know, money problems and family problems. It's one of those. But because of the fact is both her and she are not blood related, so I would say like cousins or something like that. Maybe something happened to her family or whatever. This is why I kind of feel like the great grandmother should have made an appearance in here unless the great grandmother is dead, but I don't think they uh, she is because she of course said something about her in the episode. So it literally could be anything or it could literally be nothing. Who freaking knows? I mean, we ain't gonna know until it's time, but <laughs> it, it's something. I, I mean, you don't immediately marry a guy you just met and without another reason besides, you know, you, you, you fell in love with him, you know? I mean, this ain't Frozen. <laughs> and I hate the fact that I said that, but honestly, it's true. Like, let, let's, <laughs> let's think about this in real life. Let's really be think about this. Like honestly, you know this shit would never happen in real life. I mean, Nasa is one of those boys that like mm, when they first fall in love with someone, just head over heels. I mean, we've all done it, guy or girl. We've all fallen in love when like with someone like super duper fast and super duper quickly. And sometimes some people will say don't rush into it, and you're like, you know what? Screw you! I want to rush into it if I want to. It's like that, but yeah, I mean. It's just going well for them, and I'm just so happy. And I kiss. It's, oh my god. Like, feels. Like, I can't. I'm dead. But yeah, it was a really good episode. Just want to know ish on Tsukasa and her past. It's the biggest thing that I want to know for going on five episodes in. But we ain't going to know until it's time. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to you towards episodes four of Over the Moon for you. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday. And I mean it. Next Friday. Hopefully, if I can get the fuck up early, I will go to bed super duper early if I have to. With all the other things that I have to do between, you know, making videos and other-ish. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.